three of 25 suspects being tried on manslaughter charges in the case of an elevator accident that cost 10 lives last year in Istanbul were released February 20, meaning no suspects remain behind bars in the trial. Murat Idemur, Under Turksoy, and Turgay Dokl were released by the Istanbul 13th High Criminal Court taking into account the classification of the offense, the low possibility for tampering with evidence and the period already served in detention. 21 other suspects and their lawyers also attended the hearing. During the hearing, the head of the court also announced that lawyer YLD Zemrek's demand for the recusal of the judge had been rejected by the Istanbul 14th High Criminal Court, prompting Rek to announce plans for an appeal. The court also decided to send the case to the Istanbul 15th High Criminal Court for the evaluation of the demand for recusal before postponing the hearing. Ten workers were killed at a construction site for the Turinler Center in Istanbul's Mesidiekoy neighborhood when an elevator carrying them suddenly plunged to the ground from the 32th floor on September 6, 2014. After the incident, Public Prosecutor Erdelbeck launched an investigation and demanded the 25 suspects be sentenced to between 2.5 and 22.5 years in prison on charges of manslaughter. The indictment prepared regarding the accident has previous Iouli stated that there was a lack of grounds for legal action against Turin Lurgyo Chairman Aziz Turin, as well as Yunus Emre Turin, Mehmet Turin, Lutfavard, Abdulvahit Kaplan, Tunker Akarke, Haluk Oker, Betas Aits and Osman Zemanalu.